Hey YouTube, it's Katisha Nielsen and I have a video for you today. It is a Trader Joe's haul. I spent $176, um, so let's get right to the video. And this is Solara Nelson. This is Solara, she had to get her part in too. Yeah. Okay, so we spent $176. Again, we are a family of seven. We have five kids each from nine and up into the eight month old baby. So the baby obviously doesn't eat much of this right now but um except maybe fruits i'll smash up but everything else is for a family of seven this should last us about two weeks depending on i do have a lot of other groceries from previous weeks that i bought i didn't buy any meat so we already have chicken and beef and stuff at home so let's get started um i bought two things of the organic silver dollar pancakes and the kids will just um, put these in the toaster or they'll microwave them for like 10 seconds in the morning for school and i usually serve these with like a turkey sausage for them um, along the lines of juices and liquids, I bought a thing of almond beverage um, vanilla, coconut milk. I think got a thing of orange juice, orange strawberry um, banana juice, orange peach mango juice, and pineapple juice. And mainly what I use these for is once in a while the kids will have some juice, or I mainly use it in a smoothie or make uh, like a fruit ice cream with just frozen fruit and juice and blend it. The other things I got as far as fruit would be two bags of strawberries for my smoothies. I do this, the strawberries, some um, protein powder, bananas, and the milks, um, the almond or the coconut and make it like a strawberry smoothie. Two bags of pineapple tidbits just for snacks or you know you can use them for whatever you want in yogurt by themselves. Two big things of bananas and we eat these like every day. I will freeze half of them and then use the other ones for them to take to school or just eat with um, a little bit of overnight oats. These were new and I got two of them. They were expensive, they were five bucks. Watch out, Slur. So I got a cold pressed juice in the green and a cold pressed juice in the yellow. And just to kind of show you what was in them, and the green one, it's kale, spinach, apple, cucumber, celery, lemon, and ginger juice. Um, there's 100 calories, five grams of protein, 11 grams of um, sugar, 20 carbs so and then the other one which was the cold press yellow has in it apple juice pineapple juice yellow pepper juice cucumber juice lime juice and mint juice and this is a hundred and sixty calories 38 grams carbs 33 grams sugar and protein so the sugar is very high in this but it's all natural from the fruit so there's no added sugar I bought a bag of oranges I usually just cut these up and give them to the kids for school or for myself in the morning a bag of lemons and I'm making a lemon herb chicken so I'm going to cut these and put them inside chicken and then I make my lemon water every morning which is warm water and lemons. Um, I have two things of the cage free brown eggs. We just pretty much boil these or scramble them or bake with them. A thing of my organic half and half that I have to have in my coffee. Well I don't have but I do like it. A thing of cottage cheese, organic low fat. I bought six of the Greek yogurts, the variety of flavors, so pomegranate, black raspberry, I believe this one is mango, I think the one in the bottom is um, strawberry and blueberry and then two raspberries. I bought two of their Laughing Cow cheeses, so the creamy Swiss garlic and herb, and then just the regular. And we just smooth these on crackers, or I will take it and smooth it on a bagel, or you can honestly melt it a little bit and make it with eggs and it's so good. I got a box of the Gorilla uh, Munch. Lara picked this out for breakfast. The thing of the crackers, they just like to snack on these once in a while. I bought some kefir, which has probiotics. It really helps with your stomach and um, digestion. And it just, I mean, it's very rich and creamy. It tastes good. Two things of their yogurt. One is the mango and the peach. The other one is the banana and the vanilla. And these are really creamy. They taste um, really good. And the kids just take those. I got a thing of, uh, actually a couple things of herbs for my chicken and my beef and just to kind of add a non-calorie um, seasoning. So we got rosemary, we got a thing of thyme, and one for mint. And I'm going to actually do like a, a lemon infused mint water with that. We have a bag of peeled carrots for the kids' lunches, some cucumbers for some salads I'm going to be making for me and Mike, some shredded carrots for our salads for Mike and I. Bag of carrots. I'm actually making a beef stew tonight, so I'll be using these. Some organic 
celery heart. And I just use this for chicken baked or um, I'll make like a vegetable chili and just dice up or pasta sauce with those. A thing of romaine hearts and I'm going to make the kids some lettuce wraps and cups for school. Some shredded green cabbage. I just saute this usually with a little bit of um, olive oil and bacon and salt and pepper. You can do a non-bacon version and it's just something a light side that tastes great. Or you can do Canadian bacon. I bought a thing of jasmine rice. We do oriental night so I'll do this. Um, I think of maple syrup for the kids' pancakes. My half-calf um, coffee from Trader Joe's. It was whole beans, but I ground it in store. A thing of coconut oil spray. I use this for everything as far as like my eggs or just not having to have the calories, but you can use um, it to coat the pan. I bought four things, actually three of the sparkling water. So we have a uh, lime one, an orange one, and I have a lime one. This one actually, sorry, was uh, raspberry lime. Then we bought two things of the strawberry breakfast bars or snack bars, a thing of bagels. What we have here is um, everything whole wheat uh, bagel slim. So I'll make Mike like a chicken salad for lunch or a tuna salad and we will put it on there. Or you can just do some eggs and toast if you want these. And use one side if you want, don't want all the carbs. And then we also have a thing of kettle corn. And then what we don't see here is a thing of water, which was, uh, I think, 24 waters, which ended up being like $3.99 or something like that. And then the last thing that we got were these mini milk chocolate peanut butter cups that I let Laura pick out um, because she wanted to have them. So the peanut butter cups and, oh, sorry, I always forget something. I bought a thing of their unsalted creamy peanut butter. Just a spread on toast or just to have on some bananas with either like cacao chips on it or cacao or um, just raisins or craisins. And then this sauce here was called soyaki. I'm probably saying it wrong, but it's like a teriyaki sauce. So I'm going to try this with some beef and to make it. So this was everything we got from our haul, Trader Joe's haul. Again, it was $176. So hope you like this video. And hopefully I can get some more videos up. I have so many in the archives that I needed to record um, or that I did that I just did not get up with five kids. It's kind of hard sometimes, but I do enjoy doing this. So please leave any comments and hope to see you guys watch the videos next time. Bye.